It was just after midnight this morning that the Virginia Department of Forensic Science was able to confirm through testing of ballistic evidence that was taken from both of the shooting scenes here on the Tech campus that both Officer Krauss and the male subject that was found in the parking lot approximately a half mile away uh, were shot and killed with the same weapon. And that weapon, which was a handgun, was found near the male subject in the parking lot that's known as the cage there on uh, Duck Pond Drive. Now, to review, it was at approximately 12.15 p.m. on Thursday when Virginia Tech police officer Derek Kraus had a vehicle stopped in the Coliseum parking lot along Washington Street near the intersection of Spring Road. During the course of the traffic stop, Officer Kraus was approached by an unknown male and was fatally shot. The male subject then fled on foot from the scene, and through the course of our investigation, we've been able to determine that he ran to the greenhouses where he apparently changed clothes, uh, taking off a, a pullover top and a wool cap and putting them in a backpack, which he then left there at the greenhouses. Uh, then it was a approximately about a half hour after the initial shooting, around 1245, when a Montgomery County deputy sheriff was driving through the parking lot of the cage, noticed an, a male pedestrian towards the back of the parking lot, um, observed him by himself. There was nobody else in the parking lot acting a, a bit strangely. As the, uh, the deputy then drove through the parking lot to approach him, lost sight of him at one point. When he finally did locate him, he found him laying on the ground, and uh, he had been... Uh, suffered a, a, what appears to be a self-inflicted gunshot wound, and the, uh, the handgun was found nearby.